Cheers. Cheers. Over the lips and through the gums. <laughs> Take the four. Yes. <laughs> Peanut butter cookies. <laughs> wow, that's all. <awesome. laughs> this is not good. So last night, I think I got a little too wound up. I drank, is it four beers? Ate a beef brisket with some crazy looking french fries. I drank some wine, we got back to the room. Ate chocolate chunk cookies. Passed out with my hoodie on. Woke up in a sweat. Had to go to the bathroom at 2.30 in the morning. Laid awake most of the night with a gut ache. And here we are in a diner in Forks, and I have felt better. Day one in La Push. It's a little bit misty out, but at least it's not hot. We're gonna go get the bike set up, start the ride. All right, Rob, you ready to go? Well, after a very rough morning, I think I'm ready to do this. I'm gonna strap my helmet on to my bike. <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna get her done. I'm actually gonna wear my helmet. <laughs> Talking like a bruise I'm giving myself blisters All this walking in your shoes There's nothing you can Rob's been running you. into some derailer issues So just do. bent it a little bit And we're hoping that that uh, fixes the issue Turn off that music I think you're a genius down and there we uh, started the hill climb.
glaciers. Saw those and Rob got excited. Glacia! <laughs> Glacia! <laughs> So we're in Port Angeles at a pizza shop. We just finished an awesome section of single track. Good job. Super awesome single track. Yeah. Down to PA, baby. Woohoo! Cheers. It's right now in Port Angeles for about what, 10, 15 miles. Going up a hill. A little warm day, but nice weather for the coast. Good to go. Found our camp. So happy to be here. <laughs> Eight o'clock, day two, uh, night two at our campsite next to a river. Had a pretty awesome day. Lots of single track, some pavement, some gravel. Got food in Port Angeles, uh, but the single track was so fun. So anyway, we're uh, getting ready to conk. Conkus Maximus. <laughs> Getting crushed by a hill early in the morning. Got some leftover pizza. How you feeling, Rob? Oh, I feel great. <laughs> <laughs> big ride up the hill, fun ride down, but uh, looks like we have to go on a big quillacine. Hopefully that's all single track all the way into town for breakfast. Downhill single track. Downhill single track for omelets. <laughs> so fun. <laughs> in the morning. We're gonna pack up and get going and uh, we got a ferry to catch. Can you get on? Too late? Pulled into the ferry terminal and there goes the ferry. We were literally like probably like two minutes away from boarding. <laughs> so we're gonna have to hang out here until the next uh, ferry comes. Look at that cool trick. I think that's our ferry. Chris, how do you feel about lack of doodle? Lack of doodles on this route. Too many lack of doodles.
right, it's day four, I think. And uh, it's been a long day. I think we left the Kingston area at like 5.30. And it's now 5.30. Ah! And we've been riding all day. And uh, finally found our campsite. So there's Rob. What's up, bro? <laughs> Alice Creek, we're rocking the creek. Woohoo! That was a hard day. Oh, thank God for this spot. Afternoon coffee. Ooh. The only thing better is a can of water. <laughs> <laughs> Time for a wine walk and some water filtering. All right, so we woke up at 4.30 a.m. in the Indian Casino hotel room that looked very nice, but we got no sleep in. Terrible sleep. Terrible sleep. We sleep much better on the ground. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> then we rode to the ferry in Kingston, and we had a great ferry ride across the uh, sound there. And we got over to Edmonds, and that was a bit of a shit show getting through there. Yeah. Uh, then we went on some trails, and then we went on some stupid trails, <laughs> and then we went on a power line trail. I hated that trail. Yes, and then we went on a long trail that took us to North Bend, where we went and had some lunch. And then we rode up here to, what's the name of this? Alice campground? Creek. Alice Creek Campground. Yeah. It was another 12 hour day of riding. Ooh. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. But a fabulous day of riding. It was good. It was good. Now we're just hoping we don't get soaking wet tonight. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> Starting out with a little bit of rain. Soggy. <laughs> and he poured the storm nice and dry. <laughs> A little bit soggy outside to start the day. But forecast heading east. Go for me, Cole, nine miles. to Ellensburg, grabbing a drink, and gonna go find some lodging. Best part of my day is the bike ride. And then getting a beer. No oh, wait a minute. I got that. <laughs> Hello, got to the Motel 6. Time to jump in the pool. <laughs> right here in Ellensburg. Round two. Cheers. Day six. Oh, there's our little champion rider. Five oh one. Five oh one. It's time to rock and roll. Let's do it. Taking off the puffy. We're on the John Wayne Trail. And it pretty much looks like this for a long, long time. It's just gravel grinding. But we should be uh, hitting some hills pretty soon, which I'm looking forward to and I'm a little afraid of. Twenty miles out of Ellensburg. And uh, it's 
say this is the probably the roughest terrain we've come across so far. <laughs> so just big, rocky, uh, hard to grind up. So a little bit of hike a bike action going on here. We're cruising up this road, and Rob gets our first flat. Uh -oh. Bye. Alright, so it's day seven. Just want to do a quick recap of day six yesterday. Uh, we were up in those hills over there with some gnarly ascents and some gnarly descents. Rob got chased by a dog. <laughs> we saw elk. We saw elk. Yeah. Rob got a puncture in his tire. Uh, my derailleur blew apart. We yeah. got it fixed at the uh, uh, bike shop yesterday. It was awesome. And uh, as we descended down, we thought, oh boy, we have made it. And we hit a 30 mile an hour headwind and that kind of put a damper on our day. But the beer was cold and tasting good and we got it. <laughs> yep. All right, now we're headed to Moses Lake. Ooh. Ooh. About to start our big climb of the day. See that, maybe. 1700 feet, 3.31 miles. Just getting ready to go. All right, just finished the hill climb. Woo! Looking over there, you can see the enchantments getting kind of hammered by the clouds. And we've got this cool valley over here. We're gonna venture onward. We've got some serious clouds over there and some wind, but uh, I think we're moving in the direction of clear blue skies. We've got some descent ahead of us. So, next 10 or 20 miles should be pretty fun. Yeah, pretty gnarly, and then look, and then it just goes into the stream crossing. Last <laughs> failure at stream crossing. Creek and views even out here are spectacular. All right, we're here at Moses Lake and uh, Raven caught a big old bass. Woo! That's a big one. <laughs> At the dead end. <laughs> huh. <laughs> oh god. Uh
Trail's getting a little bit soggy. Oh boy. Well, Pilgrim, if you're gonna take the John Wayne Trail, I only have two pieces of advice. Bring yourself a fat tire bike and an extra thick chamois. <laughs> she's a rough road until you hit the swamp. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> oh. Get a drink here, come up with a plan. Rob's wondering where to go. He doesn't have the GPS like I do. So he's waiting for me, wondering. But this is it right here. This is it. Rob, where do we go? Have I known where to go the entire <laughs> trip? No. See, that's what I was saying. <laughs> no idea. I just ride a bike. Bro, that road right there yeah. is called the State Line Road or something. So wow. Let's just go touch it. Here we go. Here we go. Washington to Idaho, done. Now let's go back. <laughs> back to La Push. <laughs> yo yo! <Yeah>. Woo <laughs> We're not gonna yo yo. It's over. It's over. So sad. It's over.